Southbound Medic 10, Southwest Battalion 42, Engine 42, 20,000 to Miller Road, Test Cane, Priority 2 Delta, 20,000 to Miller Road. No, he'd be zero, going, zero. if he was going east, he'd be going away from me. I think he's taking off on me. We're getting excited, boys. Hey, X-ray Frank, 2912. We're going on our what? As he unsnaps his gun. 11 for 9. Is it okay? I hear sirens. Desperado. Can I get to the next? There's a company right there. No, I can get to the next. Yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna try to stop it. So you want to be fine if you can. Have somebody come down and fly across for it. Too late. Okay, I'm gonna leave it. I can make it to work it. The block at Twelfth Street event. Drinking and smoking disease, which and violation of Notre Dame COVID policy. They advise that there is no less than 100 people possibly. They got guns pointed at them. Yeah, they're bringing I know. What is that supposed to do? Intimidation or what? Paper, you can disregard. Wake up call, yeah, right. Got back up. Back up. Back up has arrived. What's up, Dino? We got somebody refusing to get out of the vehicle. I heard they have K9 on the way. Look at this guy. Kids. No, this is pretty rural right here, this area. Yeah, just me as I think a few occupants. I think we got another pursuit. Another pursuit. What's up, the bear wood? Yeah. 
Well, I'll, I'll go farther up here. I'll do that. A little, a little bit of cover here. Death squads. Sounds like they have one detained on that. It sounded like it was just a short pursuit on Juniper. This guy, this guy's not getting out. No, the two front doors are open, but the, the rear passenger doors. Hi, Lori Van Hoosier. Got a little situation here. It's a short pursuit. One of the occupants in a vehicle is refusing to get out. I think they have K9 en route. This is on Burkett and Burkett and Eight, I believe. Mishawaka, Indiana. He's hauling, man. He's going to have to go up on the sidewalk or something because all these units are blocked. He's on the line of fire. Absolutely. Absolutely. He should have... I would have drove it up on the sidewalk there and around behind. Yep, David Brenny. All right, Jane Ella, thank you. I'm just out here to document, and that's that's uh, this developing situation here live. Watch your crossfire. Yeah, I, I stepped over this way because of there is a brick barrier right there and an officer behind that. I think we got K9 here. I heard the officer say we got two out. Oh, you're heading this way, Leo Watcher? Shit. Flashbang. Goodness. Man, 
man, the concussion from that was. Was crazy. He's going in the woods. I think his name's Andy. That was crazy, dude, that flashbang. What's up, Del Del? This is where it's all gonna, when he lets go of that dog and that dog goes inside the car, it's all gonna come to a T here. Another K9 here. Sure. Looks like a kid. Yeah, there's, you know, there's probably seven or eight officers here, at least. Yeah, that scared the crap out of me. That's, that's, that's about close to what blew my hand off. Yeah. I know that would do permanent damage. The concussion from that thing was... I felt it back here. Whew, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 